we have 65 year old contractor framer Keith and he's been in pain for a ton of years has ADHD since he was a kid low back pain sciatica hip pain that won't stop he can't surf anymore ride motorcycles or snowboard without serious pain here we're doing some range of motion studies you can see him struggling with some of these and this balance is way off here x-rays tons of arthritis atlas is almost gone here's ridiculous arthritis in his low back we adjusted him oh shit just like all the other chiropractors, right? No, oh, no. Keith, uh, almost 65, I'm a framing contractor. Don't want to be in pain anymore doing the things I love to do. Uh, lower back, hip pain, off and on, 30. 30 years, exactly. Yeah, almost everything I like to. Yeah, yeah. Work, everything. He loves to surf. He had to go from actual laying down, jumping up to what? Sup. Sup. <laughs> sup. Sup. Sup, dick. Snowboarding. Snowboarding. I mean, uh, Can you do dirt it? Dirt bike riding. Everything. And all, it stopped all of that stuff? No, I mean, I do it, but I'm in pain. It gets to where I can't even walk. Gotcha. Five times a week. And he has some sciatic too, guys, down his back of his leg too. How many chiropractors you went to over the years? Ten. And what'd they say to you? Said when the pain gets too bad, they can give me ep ep epidurals, pinpoint it with the x-ray. The x-rays are pretty messed up. He said he's had a wall fall on him or something like that in the past. And so, you know, he's a construction guy. Fuck. How much pain you're back there? Four. Four. Take your time. You guys see that motion he does there? You yeah. see that motion? How much pain, sir? Five. Ready to have uh, your life changed? Yes, sir. Let's go. The x-rays are messed up. He's lost all his teeth. And the reason I point that out, guys, is because you guys are always like, why are you talking about teeth? Well, the more pressure you have on your neck, the more you grind your teeth. He pulverizes his teeth. At 65, you should have still more teeth than that. Tons of arthritis in his neck. His mid-back has freaking hooks, like meat hooks in there. His hip is arthritic. We have nine millimeter left in balance, 11 degree scoliosis, TMJ, and really bad arthritis. Here we have 10 millimeter right short leg, phase four arthritis in the back, and phase two arthritis in the hips. 90% wear on the atlas, teeth are gone, phase three arthritis at C3, C4. Here we have a close up of the neck destruction from the arthritis, and here we have low back significant arthritis. Keith's problem is himself. He doesn't realize this yet. He's got so much energy, he doesn't know how to slow down. And so the hard, the hard part this week will be calming him down. Okay, the one that I like hate the most on him is C2, C3. I'm gonna go right through C3 on him, maybe a tiny bit higher because uh, that's where the most arthritis is. The spine is probably phase three arthritis through there, right there. You can feel that right there. Let me go through here. Oh, shh. Just like all the other chiropractors, right? No. Oh. No, no one's really ever done anything like that. Pin me like a pretzel. I ain't gonna touch his hip. I ain't gonna touch his back. We're gonna see how he's doing right after this, okay? So, um, anyways, uh, let's get the other side done. He's probably a little scared now after that one. Let's relax her, good. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> Is this a, something different, huh? Didn't expect yeah. that. Well. Gotcha. I'm reframing your spine. How about that? There you go. See all that, that yeah, anxiousness wanting to move? That's your self adjusted You've got to break that habit. We're going to help Keith up here because he's going to be a little lightheaded after that treatment. We're also reminding him not to twist or turn or he will undo my work. It's very important to stay still. Let my work settle in. Let's listen and see how he's doing. I feel better. What do you feel better? How do you feel better? I mean, I, I'm more relaxed in my neck. So there's something already different, okay? Now, we're going to have you walk, and that walk's going to help recalibrate your spine. What does that mean? It's going to take that leverage thing I told you about the brain work. It's going to pass it down through your body. So it's really important not to fuck with it. Look straight ahead, relax, let nature do its job. It is very important to walk after the adjustment. It's what I call recalibration. It spreads that adjustment from the neck all the way through the body through the closed kinematic chain. Now, slowly, but don't touch your toes. That was a four a minute ago, I think. Yeah, three. A little different? A little different. Okay, back like this, sir. That was a five, I think you said a minute ago. Or different. Four. Different? Three. Oh, three, a little different, huh? Spread your feet a little, please, sir. This is a good one, guys. Squat. Different. Doesn't hurt as bad. And? One other thing you guys saw it too, we all saw it. What else? What else did you feel? I mean, anything else besides the pain? Did it feel easier to go down and Yes. Go? Yeah, see, more power guys too. 
I've only met you once before this, right? Yes. Have I adjusted anything else in your body? No. What did I touch on you? My neck. Say bye, Keith. Bye bye. I'm going to push on your shoulders here. Oh. It's going to hurt a lot. Oh, no. Okay, we're just getting started. Ow, 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 ow. I know, I know. Shit. Breathe in your nose, out your mouth. <sighs> It hurts. Where does it hurt? On your shoulders? Yeah, on my head? shoulders. It does really it hurt? hurts. I know, I get it. I sir. don't like it. I know. Do the best you can to take it. I'm only pushing like 50% right now. Slow, deep breaths. In the nose, out the mouth. Take your time. Fuck. I didn't even get to what I wanted to do. Fuck. That was as light as I could go. Wow. People beg me for this. Do I that know, thing, I'm Dr. Derek. I'm begging you for that. Okay, again, you say a lot of things. You say a lot of absolutes. You also told me, don't worry, I won't take a nap. I won't be tired. I'm going to adjust the lower part of your neck here. Just drop your head this way. Okay. Yeah, that You okay? Be. Yeah. Come this way. I know you don't want me to do this, but I'm going to push your shoulders one more time. It's going to be painful. I don't know. It doesn't hurt as, as much. As much, right? Feel pretty good. A little lightheaded. A little lightheaded, yeah. lightheaded right? Feel good. Uh, there's been some challenges, but uh, it all worked out really well. I feel way more relaxed. My He hasn't touched my hip, which I came in here for, and it feels 85% better. So, I mean, it, it's kind of amazing, and uh, I, I'm kind of a hard-headed guy, so for me to take what he has told me and be able to turn this around, I'm actually proud of myself. So. I am proud of him too. When I first met him last week to do his x-rays, I said, well, oh, this guy's gonna be a pain in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> old guys rule, because I'm an old guy now, but the problem is that old guys have uh, are hard-headed, and uh, this guy is as hard-headed as they come, um, but he's not actually. I think he's actually a, a sheep in wolf's clothing a little bit. And so um, I've got to know him this week, and I think he's much, he, he, put, up a, he put up a more of a barrier than I thought, and uh, I was wrong, and so he was actually a wonderful student, and he did really good. I mean, you've just been working on my neck, and it's made everything, I think me got, being able to relax and ape hands, it's, uh, it's what I needed. You've been to over 10 chiropractors over the years. You said this, all Newport chiropractors all around here. You've done it all. It's money well spent, believe me. And I'm not rich or anything, so you know it was hard, a little hard to come up with whatever, but it'll change your life. How's your sciatica too? Uh, non-existent. ADHD. He came in all buzzing off the top. You may be able to see it in the first video, and we talked about that this morning. How is your? How, how do you feel your ADHD, which he's had all his life, feel? Definitely better. Uh, you know, as long if you can learn to relax, uh, it. it it solves half that problem. Yep. His sleep, which he laughed at me the first day, I said, you will be sleepy. I don't sleep! The sleep's been good. I, I mean, there was one night I didn't even wake up at all, so it was amazing. Anyways, uh, wonderful experience. I like this guy a lot, and he's going to take me surfing with him. A wonderful transition for this guy. He's so much more relaxed. Good. Can we have your head? Can we have your head? Yeah, it didn't even hurt as much. For the whole week it hurt, guys. Uh, yeah. Can we have this one? So this one. Hey guys, this is only five days later. Can you tell them how much my per how much you love my personality, by the way? <laughs> 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 yeah, if you get through two days without wanting to strangle them, you'll be you'll be doing good. I can't wait to cut them off out in the water. Exactly. <laughs> how much pain there, sir? Not much. Half, one, half. Maybe one. Short board, here I come.